Guten, Guten Tag. Tag, I'm Jared. I'm Laura, and today we are headed to the second high speak in the Fokusbeak area. We are going to Horrorod's Cup, so come along with us. Los Gates. Los Gates. It is raining a little bit, so. It is. It, we just got in the car, <laughs> and it's drizzling, so hopefully it clears up by the time we get there. I know. It's been cloudy all morning. We were like, okay, let's get out of the house. Should be great to, you know, go out, hike, enjoy the weather, and then as soon as we got into the car, started to rain. So let's see how today goes. <laughs> Lass uns anfangen. Lass uns anfangen. Wir brauchen Benzin. So. Here's Jared, filling the gas tank. We'll bring the ladies along with us. I don't know if you can see them in there. Little carriers. There's Winnie. So, yeah, let's see. It's still raining a little bit. So look at that gas price. Oh, shoo mama. It's crazy, but whatever. We need to drive, so. Laura was born there in that back hospital. I sure was. Not here at this Neto store. Back there. It's definitely one thing we will not get tired of is just seeing the countryside here in Germany. It is just simply beautiful. beautiful. Breathtaking. Might be difficult to see, but on clear days you can see the skyline of Frankfurt. And we actually see it now. I'm trying my best to get it on the camera, but yeah, today's clear enough, which kind of surprising because it was raining the whole way we came up and now it is clear and as beautiful as ever. Behind me is an old telecommunications tower. It was built in the 1970s and it's under 150 meters high, so it's pretty cool. It's not in use anymore, but it's pretty cool to look at. You can see it when you're driving up to Horod's Cup. You can see it in the distance on top of the hill, so it's pretty cool. Behind me is a ski slope that is open here in the winter. It is approximately 1200 meters long and it is the longest ski slope here in Hessen. Obviously the ski slope is open in the winter times and the summer times here they have a slide you can go down. It really hurts. We've done it before and we hit our heads on the side of the metal slide but this will be fun to check out in the winter. We've never been skiing before and it's only 25 minutes away from us so we will definitely check that out. That'll be fun. There must be some bike meet up here because there's a bunch of bikers here, so it's pretty cool to see. They all came up up on the hill just to enjoy a lunch here on Horodotskop, so it's pretty cool. I don't know why, but this tree is cool. It, oh, the other side's cool too. It's really neat. I want to like climb through it. I know. It makes me want to like build a fort right underneath, camp out here. <laughs> it's cool. Yeah. I wonder what it looks like if it, I don't know if it blooms, but it's really It neat. just looks really cool. I want to go look at the tree. Oh, okay. You, you and your like animals. Schaffen? Schaffen. Schaffen. Yep. Look at all of the sheep. Biel Schäfer. I think that's sheep. Schäfer? They're so cute. That one's just eating a tree. What do they eat? Just grass all day? Hi! Hello! Hi ladies. It is super busy today. It's a Saturday, so obviously everyone's out of work and school and they're here. So there's lots of people. So we're trying to get clips without getting everyone's face in it. We packed some wraps to eat and some bubbly water to drink. The sun is blaring in our face right now. We are a little warm, but we have a beautiful view. We're just gonna chill out with the girls and eat a quick snack. There's actually quite a bit of stuff to do up here on Horodskop. There's a beer garden where you can kind of sit uh, have some food, enjoy a beer. There's also a, not a jungle gym, but what it's is like it? It's a climbing forest climbing with forest. a bunch of obstacle courses. You have to wear a helmet and you have to be strapped to the trees, but there's like, um, you can do different height challenges and walk through the woods and climb through the trees and stuff, which is pretty cool. There's also a big metal slide you can go down. When we came here last year, we, we did it and it really hurt. We went too fast and hit our heads on the side of the mm -hmm. metal slide multiple times. So we didn't do it this time. Plus no. we have the dogs, but it was pretty fun. It, you could, it takes you all the way down the mountain, which is pretty cool. We're sitting here watching people do it now. So it's pretty cool to watch and just enjoy. My first time in Germany, we came to Horodotskop within the first couple days and it was absolutely beautiful. That's kind of when I 
first saw the German countryside, except in the airplane and obviously driving through uh, our hometown. So it was just awesome to see the German countryside the first time ever uh, in my life when I came here. So this does have a special place, special memory, I guess to say, not in a weird way, but a uh, special memory here for me up here on Hohenoldskopf, just first time really being in Germany and seeing the beautiful countryside. You simply can't beat these views. If you're in the area, I would definitely come and check it out. It's super easy to get to. You just have to pay for parking. You can mm -hmm. walk around. We bought our own food to eat. We could have bought food here, but we we're like, let's pack a snack. It's just a lot of fun. You can ride your bike up here. There's hiking paths, bike paths. There's mm -hmm. a bunch to do. There's so. a lot to do. You don't even have to, besides parking, pay for really anything. You can just, what we did, we paid for parking and then we just walked around, enjoyed, enjoyed the, the scenery, the sights, oh. and really that was it. Now you can obviously make really a day of it and do a lot of things but you can also just come up here and relax and just take in the nature it is beautiful absolutely beautiful the drone footage here would be amazing here, but oh my bad <laughs> bikers not being going to memories drone footage would be awesome up here but there are so many people i don't want to risk it get in trouble i just wish simply you could just see it because man oh man it is beautiful. And there's people going by on the slide. Whee! <laughs> it is such a process putting the girls back in their bags. It's like having children. Oh Can my. You hear them back there? We took off their sweaters because it got warm and then they wouldn't get back in the bag and we're in the parking lot and I'm more crazy. out of breath. That's Heidi digging around her carrier. She's I'm more out of breath putting them away in their bag than I was walking. Walking up, a hill. up the hill. Up a mountain. <sighs> Crazies. But it was a fun day today. We did not have any rain, which was awesome. Yes, it cleared it up was... the second we got here. It yes. was done. <laughs> <laughs> Heidi. Oh gosh. These dogs. Oh, but it was awesome. Great day just to walk around, enjoy the scenery. We hope you enjoy. Stay tuned for future videos. Hit that like, subscribe, and once again, we'll catch you next time. Max cool. Cheers!